Hello, my name is Serena Adair and welcome to my channel. Welcome to my very first video. So a lot of my friends have been telling me throughout the years that I need to start a YouTube channel because I love to teach yoga. I've been a yoga teacher for the last couple of years and I really love to share everything about self-love and self-growth because I used to be really struggling in the past. And so it's been a real passion of mine to share everything that I've learned. I am this week going on my very first solo trip to California. Back in January 2019, my yoga studio introduced the Deepak Chopra's 21 day meditation challenge to me. And I'm going to link it in the comments below because it is amazing. And I now for the last, since January 2019, I have done that challenge over and over again, whether it's doing it one day, two day, three day, four, or just picking a random day whenever I feel called to it. And the words and the power in those meditations, if you have ever had trouble learning or being able to get into a meditation, this is a very powerful way to start. So my first solo trip to California, I am going to be seeing Deepak Chopra and it's a three day event and I cannot be more excited. I am going to start, go home and I'm gonna start packing and I cannot wait. I'm leaving on the 28th and I'll be there during Halloween. So it'll be so fun, I can't wait. At Nananda Yoga Studio, the place that started it all, here's a little sneak peek of my room. I think I'm gonna do a separate video for a room tour. At Mananda is the reason that I am even going on this trip and I am so thankful and so grateful for all that I have learned with them. If you have ever been interested in anything having to do with yoga or meditation or deepening your practice in any way or even becoming a teacher, comment below, ask me any questions, do not hesitate. I am Today here. Today is the day and we are off to Deepak Chopra. No matter how many times I see this view, it is always breathtaking. Finally made it to the airport. Here we are and here we grow. I couldn't have been more excited this morning. I didn't sleep all night. I stayed up until my flight at seven in the morning and then I had the best breakfast. This was a airport restaurant and they had this. I was so thankful to be starting off my trip just right. I wish the camera could ever do justice to just how beautiful the sunrise, the sunset, and even just the clouds in general look from the outside of a plane window. It is my favorite view, or one of my favorite views, looking at the world from outside of a plane. It makes you feel so small. It really separates you from everything that we think is such a big deal. It allows you to really pull back and notice. Your tables will put away, and I'll turn on some security Please just continue to use small large electronic devices and leave them off until you're inside the terminal building. By the time we pass into the cabin, the walk on a time to pick up any So I have finally landed at my first stop in Florida, and my next plane is in a couple hours, and I am so I hopped up the plane at LAX with a dream of some legal weed. Welcome to the okay. land of fame excess. Woo! Am I gonna fit in? I jumped in the cab, here I am for the first time. Look to my right and I see the Hollywood sign. This is all so crazy. Everybody seems so famous. <laughs> this drive was so beautiful. I watched those birds for so long. Yay. California dreaming. 
I was so happy when I saw this. I'm so thankful and so grateful for Brian, who I met at Atmananda, another synchronicity. He had just recently moved here, and so he was able to pick me up from the airport and show me around his new home. We ended up on Manhattan Beach, which was another synchronicity because that is where the studio that we met was at. And this sunset was beyond breathtaking. We sat here for a while, just toes in the sand, watching the birds, listening to the waves. I feel so grateful to be here, to be breathing, to be alive, and that you're listening. We dive into the future, but we're blinded by the sun. We're reborn in every moment, so who knows who will become? Allow yourself to take a moment here and be grateful for every evolution of you. You are so beautiful. Now let's get something to eat. It's all vegan, baby. All vegan, baby. <laughs> And now we're on our way to Well Within. How fitting is it that this was the sticker on the car that took me to the event? We made it, we made it. I'm feeling grateful. This entire property is just so gorgeous and so breathtaking. So I am finally here and I finally made it to the Deepak Chopra Well Within. <laughs> I am so excited. This property is more than gorgeous and I cannot wait to dive into everything that we have planned. This place truly has views for days. You can walk around and walk around and walk around and still not see everything. It's almost like a gorgeous maze. Being right next to the ocean and all of this wildlife, this bird of paradise, birds of paradise, it is just so beautiful. Look at that little bee. I have finally finished checking in and now I am poolside diving into this goodie bag that they gave us. Chopra programs change how you perceive the world. At first, you might come here for knowledge to better your health or career, but after the program, you will learn how to live a good life more mindfully. Now let's get into the room. I was not even expecting this. I walked in and there were two beds. And so what does Serena do when she finds two beds? Stay tuned to find out. When I first walked in here, I thought this bathroom had no toilet, but here it is. So I guess I'll just use one bed one night and the other bed the other night. Can't let them go to waste. Wow, this view is just incredible. Again, I am so thankful and so grateful to be here, to be alive, to be breathing. <sighs> wow. And now we are into the journey welcome to well within and now it's time for the nightly festivities we had our spiritual forum deepak chopra spoke and then i went on a beautiful walk through this trail right after our sessions we met up for a beautiful dance party under the sunset and i had the best time we had all of these beautiful vegan desserts and they were so 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 yummy and after the dance party, we went in, finished off the night with some gentle yoga nidra. If you've never done any yoga nidra, I definitely suggest it. It's a beautiful practice that really allows you to get in tune with your body and to get in tune with this moment. And then I did some somatic sound healing. This room was beautiful. We all put on headphones of our own and we had Tibetan bowls and just different sounds resonating in the headphones and you could feel it throughout your entire body. So thankful for this. And we made it. Day one complete. I am so thankful and so excited. 
for everything that's to come. We, they gave us this amazing little journal and it is just day one and let's take a gander. <laughs> I have never, <laughs> yeah, day one, day one, day one. And this is for the rest of the weekend. We did a spiritual forum today. We had Deepak Chopra come out. That was incredible. I did some yoga nidra. I did some somatic sound healing and it was all so amazing. I cannot wait to do another one of these. I'm already thinking about it. And that is a wrap on day one. I am so thankful and so grateful that you guys came along on this journey with me. This is Serene Space. And if you have any suggestions or any questions, comments, concerns, anything you wanna share, I'm so excited for this to be my very first video. And I can't wait to do more and to hear from you guys. So let me know anything you want and I'll be here. I am so thankful, I am so grateful, and I am blessed.